said I really wanna love you I just wanna hug you Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Pat Duhelio and for today's video, we are going to visit my home province, um, Bicol. Um, we're going to stay here for five days and four nights and this is going to be our day one um, for our itinerary wherein we are going to visit Legazpi. Um, so watch out for that later today. Um, currently, I am checked in here at Givia Harris Transient Hotel uh, here in Naga. Later, um, I will go to SM Naga to wait for my friends to pick me up to start a day one tour. So, hope you guys enjoyed my video and please like and subscribe if you haven't still. So, thank you. Bye bye. Okay, let's do a quick room tour first before we check out. I booked one standard room for one night via Agoda for 900 pesos and for me the amenities are worth the price. They have one queen size bed and in front we have a balcony where you can view the city streets. Their air condition is working well. I didn't have the trouble sleeping last night. For the bathroom, the only thing missing here is the water heater, but apart from that, everything's fine. I do love that they have a window here, that way you don't have to turn on your light during the day. The Vihera Chanchant Hotel is located at the second floor of City Central Bus Terminal in Naga, so if you're traveling from Manila via bus, this is an accessible hotel for you. If you're interested in booking in their hotel, I'll just put their FB page in the description box. So going back, we have a TV and a large mirror of course for our fit check. Lunch time! So comfortable and no one seems to hold me like you do. Here we are at Mayon Sky Drive ATV Adventure in Kagsawa Road, Daraga Albay for our first activity of the day. We avail the Green Lava Trail for 1,850 pesos per pax. This is a 1.5 kilometers round trip ride for approximately 1 to 2 hour ride depending on the group's driving performance.
Good evening, everyone. After those extraneous activities earlier, I am so hungry right now. But here we are at Farm Plate here in Taragaalbay. And may I say, if you are planning for a date night here in Bicol, this place is perfect for it. Good morning! So it's day 2 of our Bicol tour and as of now we are traveling to Sorsogon and our first stop is Matnog. No one seems to hold me like you do. Mm -hmm. You're so wonderful. A star could never shine as bright as you. Mm -hmm. Even the dark, they still see light. Even the birds still sing at night. Every word just. Hindi na kami pinayagan ni Kuya to enter the Kalintan Cave because of the water level. So we just enjoyed it from afar. Can't believe that I get to see those eyes from both ends tonight. This way you must have felt from the sky, and I feel. Welcome to Kasiguran Sorsogon and its newest eco-tourist attraction, the 16,000 Blue Roses. Well, it's white now because it's still the afternoon. Probably out there somewhere missing me Wish I had an ounce of sympathy Yeah, I tell my friends that I wish you well But the truth is, honey, that I hope it hurts like hell Like hell When you see me leaving here with someone else Well, the truth is, honey, that I hope it hurts like hell
before we end the day, I figured, why not give you a quick room tour? So we've been staying here at Hotel Yatris for the past two nights now. And right here, we have their CR, which is pretty spacious naman for me. Plus, they have a water heater. So... <laughs> And by the way, guys, I hope you're enjoying the first two tours that we had. And I hope you're staying in tune for our day 3 to 5 for our Karamoan activities. Now, going back, we have... Oh, let me just turn off the lights. Okay. And right here, we have our desk, a TV, and also two beds. And that's it. Good night, everyone. After almost 8 hours of travel from Albay with countless of sharp curves, we are finally here in Karamoan. We are staying at Residencia de Salvacion here in Paniman for the next two days. And just when you think the day is over, we still must go elsewhere because we're booked for a short island hopping. And so here's me filming this beautiful view by the beach just outside the hotel while waiting for our banca. Welcome to Lajos Island. Fun fact, this island disappears during high tide. That is where its name came from, Lajos, which means vanish. Our second island is Matukad Island, which is famous for its enchanted bangus or milkfish. Located in a lagoon surrounded with spiky rock formation, which is exciting to climb, by the way. It was said that the story of those mysterious fish happened over 20 years ago when a tidal wave came and it filled the surrounding rocks, forming a lagoon where the two bangos emerged. If you're still with me at this point, Thank you so much for staying. I am a newbie in vlogging, so if you have an item for improvement for me, please feel free to comment it in this video. I would highly appreciate it. Thank you! Here we are on our first island top of the day, the Ginhoan Island. With just a short ascent, this island is famous for its scenic grassland followed by a lighthouse surrounded by an open sea. By the time you arrive, you'll be greeted by children offering assistance for your climb on top of the hill. One more thing I learned about the people living here is their school. The island only have elementary school, so high school students still need to travel to another island to attend school. They ride Bangka every Sunday afternoon to go there and spend their weekdays with their relatives, while some opted to rent dormitory and return home the following weekend. All this to learn. These children amaze me and they remind me to always be grateful in life no matter the hardships. So if you happen to meet them on your visit here, please allow them to assist you document your stay because it will also help them. And of course, I mean, just look at the quality of their shots. <laughs>
Traveling won't be complete without cafe hunting. So here we are at Cafe Real, just a quick walk away from the hotel. Good morning! It's our last day here in Karamoan. We still have two destinations planned for today, the Deer Farm and CWC. But I will not be able to film those as I have an early ride to catch back to Manila. So that's the end of our Bicol tour. I hope you enjoyed the whole vlog as much as I enjoyed filming it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and see you on the next one. Bye!